Hey everybody, it's Kimo here. In today's video, we're gonna play on the cleric. Recently, recently, the Iron Mace have come out with the big, massive, drastic patch that uh, drastically nerfed our poor fellow cleric. And um, basically, what they did is they gave three seconds cooldown to the faithfulness, and this change is extremely drastic. And uh, I don't think this class is playable anymore. It's actually really, really bad as of right now. But before we get to the video, I want to remind you, only 11% of people who are watching my channel has subscribed. The rest didn't. Consider the subscribe button if you're interested in a variety of broken builds, because this is what my whole channel is based on. But anyway, let's go back into today's video. So yeah, yeah, yeah. What about my cleric uh, agenda? Oh, the cleric is horrible. Oh yeah, oh god, oh god damn. Here, here, here. L let me let me pull the notes. Let me pull the notes. It's right here. So basically the Iron Mace has come out with the big massive patch. And um basically they did a couple of things. They nerfed through it, they buffed Stinky Stick, and um now now if you're trying to team to kill the Wyvern, you're gonna get banned. But on top of that, they threw a little change that nobody is talking about, and that's the cleric faithfulness has Three seconds cooldown after activation, and also the smite got got it out from 100% to 75. So pretty much, if you're gonna throw a bunch of additional magical damage, this additional magical damage gonna suck dick uh, 0.75% compared to the usual 1% that you previously had. I mean, compared to uh, usual 1.0. So well, I mean the drastic, the difference is drastic. This class is unplayable. The cleric is in fact horrible. Like, I'm not even sure how you're supposed to play this class anymore, like, with all these changes. Um, like, basically, now, after you cast the Faithfulness, there's gonna be a long, massive, huge delay, you know. It's, like, solid three seconds. It's, like, them. I, I honestly have no idea what am I supposed to do, like, you know, with all these drastic changes on the Cleric. Like, you know, I've been trying to think how what I could do to make this build work, but I guess we would just have to figure it out, you know what I mean? Like, <clears throat> like the faithfulness is with a three second cooldown, which is the um, debuff. Well, I mean, like, how can you even play this class with uh, such a drastic, you know, downgrade and nerf? I don't know, man. I don't know. But like, we'll definitely would need to figure it out it out and we gotta see for ourselves if this class is actually still playable but uh even though even though we all love this class and we all understand you know what is the current reality and uh, that iron mace just hates this man of god and decide to completely nerf it down completely annihilate it and give the three second sec three seconds of a negative penalty um which is a debuff um But yeah, anyway, we're gonna hop into the video and we're gonna go and clap some chicks. The build we're gonna be running with is gonna be the Holy Aura. And um, the reason why I'm gonna be playing with the Holy Aura is simply uh, because I'm gonna get a little, little bit of cheese, you know. Extra armor, extra magical resistance. We gotta use the Faithfulness, Perseverance, Protection from Evil. The reason why we're using Holy Aura instead of the Blunt Weapon is mainly due to the fact that the Blunt Weapon is not gonna benefit the magic stuff, unfortunately. And well, it is what it is. So yeah, you could see the um, weapon type magic stuff, and um, it doesn't have the uh, weapon type mace or the you know. Basically, that's why it's just not gonna work. You know, it had it's gotta be a mace. It's gotta be mace if you want blunt weapon mastery to affect it. So yeah. Anyway, we're gonna go into the game. I'm gonna throw a bunch of mats. We're gonna go clap some cheeks. This is the little beautiful kid that I'm, I'm gonna be playing with. There is nothing crazy. I'm fairly slow. Around 280 move speed. I'm using the um, sanctum, uh, copper light sanctum, sanctum, what the, sanctum pla uh, plate armor. Sorry, I've been, I've been awake for quite a while, and but I still decided to come up with a little video. So yeah, anyway, let's hop in the video and let's go clap some chicks. All right, so looks like we have a wizard here. Interesting. I honestly don't mind really. I'm kind of used to fighting wizards and other kind of stuff. But yeah, I mean, usually if you come across those guys, well, just uh, go and spend some time of theirs, make sure that, uh... 
Make sure that when you come to a fight, they don't have every fucking fireball in the book. Because if they do, well, that's gonna be a problem. This guy didn't have a chess piece. He is a pretty fast one also. What? He fucking decided to squirt down and get his stuff back? You gotta be fucking kidding me. But, uh... Yeah, the fact that he does have a chess piece doesn't mean that uh, um, he's not a threat. This guy has a bunch of rings with additional magical damage. I know that for sure because I fucking inspect him. Oh, he fucking stuck it up. I will let him hit me one more time. And I'm gonna use the shrine. He's gonna walk in. If you're gonna... Oh, well, that was a little unexpected. Okay, back to the plan. Yep, he's gonna fucking throw a bunch of stuff at me. We're just gonna open the close the door up. Eventually, he's gonna blow the door up. Well, that's basically the usually do. Didn't expect he would use this kind of explosion. Normally, it's just fireballs, but it is what it is. It's not that deep. Okay. Looks like he's kind of running out of zaps because he decided to switch to fucking lightning strikes. It's okay. We're just gonna kite around until the point when he is kind of low on resources. Not sure if that's gonna do anything. That's not even gonna impact on um, the invisible potion if I would ever have one. But never use those. <laughs> probably I should. I probably should actually start using the invisible pods. Okay. Just a couple more skills down. Just a way to do it. And he used the explosion, which kind of hit him as well. Honestly, honestly, I thought that um, that explosion will end up killing him, but I guess I was slightly faster. God damn, homie got some cheese. True, true, true. Even though this is not a lot, like, build like this, especially on the wither, does possess a lot of threat. Because, like, goddamn, you just go and throw a bunch of fireballs, get into melee, a couple of bongs, that's it. You win the fight, simple as that. Just make sure you have the arcane shield. I would say the arcane shield absolutely slaps, especially when it comes to fighting other players one on one. Honestly, I'm not sure if I should be playing on Withered, but um, I probably played on a cleric way too much. And probably making the same video on the cleric, I mean, gonna get a little stale. So, yeah, let me know if you would be interested to see some wizard content. If not, I would understand and I will never play that class. Simple as that. Sometimes later, I came across a rogue. The rogue seemed like a homie. He didn't want no beef and he recognized me. Well, I mean, couldn't kill him. Uh, I was just not allowed, period, simple as that. So we just Bro, talked a little bit for a couple of minutes and separated. Looks like someone was here. Let's go see what we have. You bitch! <laughs> that was actually terrifying. Bro, this rogue is actual fucking menace. Piece of shit, bro. Holy fuck. <laughs> ah, I messed up my judgment. It's okay. Oh, gotta heal up. He doesn't really do that much damage, but he does put a threat. You gotta be careful here. I feel like if I will try to walk in, he's gonna go fucking invis and he will do a perfect couple of solid hits on me. This homie is dangerous, I'm telling you. Fucking... I ain't somebody to mess around with, but uh, he doesn't have a weak point to my surprise, which is uh, a little weird. Alright, so I would assume he's gonna do the same fucking process right freaking here behind this wall. He's gonna go in with. Where the freak this homie is at? Ah, you piece of shit. <laughs> this never gets old. Ideally, ideally, I want him to push me. So that I could do this. Ah, oh, man, he's fast, brother. Bitch. Even without armor, I'm actually quite tanky, so... Holy fuck! 
Jesus Christ, brother, scared the fuck out of me. Holy hell. I don't want to get surprised like I usually do, so we're gonna quickly take all the cheese. And we gotta get the fuck out of here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's a good come up. Probably a couple thousand. Half a pelt in his inventory. Definitely not bad. Well, I wasn't really able to find anyone, but, um... Do we have someone here? Oh, we have a barb. Well, let's go fuck with the barb, I guess. No traps. Alright, whoever was here took the extract out. Okay, a bunch of stuff on the floor, interesting. Homie is trying to escape, I would assume. That's his plan. Mm, he pre-charged his attack? Sure. Oops, I missed. But that was a clean bunk. Oh. Well, I guess two headshots sometimes all it takes. I'm kind of surprised he died that quick. I thought it would take a little more. Also, he felt pretty slow to me. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, yeah, some of those was actually chunky. Not bad, not bad. We have a board here. Okay, I don't want to deal with this guy honestly he doesn't have much it would be a complete waste of time if anything i want to go mess with the cleric we have a one very geared homie somewhere here oh here we go what the fuck okay i missed my second attack bro i always do what the fuck is this shit i'm in a bad spot here Okay. That's good for me. I did mess up here pretty bad, I'm gonna be honest. I probably should not be doing the full combo and just go with one singular attacks, but just the fucking bad habit. It's okay, though. It's okay. Alright. The beauty of blue bandages. And the green potions. You just get to heal up a little faster. But they do fucking cost a lot in the market. Holy cow. That was cinematic. Let's slightly walk away. One. Two. Three. Oh. He didn't really do that much damage to me. But I know for a fact his stuff is pretty pretty. Now, okay, okay. Looks like Bard fucked off a little. But, um... Little does he know. <laughs> nah, I think he's about to give up. Come on, brother, you can do it, please. Please, one arrow, man. Don't make me disappointed. It's okay, we're just gonna load the homie, I guess. Okay. Bunch of interesting cheese. He brought in resourcefulness. Is it uh, so that his uh, stuff will recover faster or something? Interesting. We also have a ball. Up. Not necessarily fighting anyone already at this point because I already got some cheese. <laughs> he said he doesn't want no smoke. <laughs> okay, okay. We might as well go take extract out and uh, let the homie be, I guess. Oops, I didn't mean to fall down. It's okay. Let's get out of here somehow. Bro, I somehow was able to... You piece of shit, let me get out of here. That's my elevator, that's my lift, brother. <laughs> Uber premium. One seat only. I'm not gonna let anyone fucking take my spot, bro. I pay for it. All right, the bar pull me. <laughs> I still chill, bro. This homie is really chill. God damn, bro. The whole lobby of juicers. Holy cow, this is incredible. It's been a minute since the last time we got those. Oh shit, this homie is a demon form guy. I would assume it's a 330 move speed demon form build or something. Yeah, this shit is terrifying. If anything, if anything, I'm probably gonna make a video on a demon form um, warlock build.
because I think currently it's way too OP and um, you gotta use it before it get nerfed out. You know, simple as that. Bro, this homie just murdered two people. Where could he be? So I came from south and um, mobs are still here. The chances that there's gonna be two spawns on the left intersection is actually quite low. Fuck, I went wrong direction. I would assume, I would assume either south all the way or, oh, fuck, I'm gonna get hit. Or we go north to the shrine. Usually that's where you're gonna get the closest encounters. That's where the two closest spawns actually are. And we gotta go check. I'm almost 100% certain it's either here or maybe by the river. Because there is no, oh, yep, we have a door open here. Mm, I would assume sh oh. Okay, well, that guy is not good. No, that's not the guy, that's not the guy. We're looking for the homie with the Chris dagger. And also, we're not trying to kill naked people. Only geared, only geared. Oh, yep, this is the homie. What? Oh, uh, what? What What was the play, brother? He cancelled it? Why would he cancel the demon form? I don't understand. Hmm. Interesting. I need to think. Hmm. Let me actually think about what he just did here. So, he used the BOC, right? He opened the door. He walked inside. He tried to squeeze in for something. Um, I was already casting at a time my judgment. So, he decided to actually use the demon form. Oh, holy fuck, we have two people fighting. Oh, well, that's two dead people right here. Well, that's one for now, but there's gonna be two. I'm still trying to figure out what did that homie warlock did there. So, he tried to squeeze in, and then he cancelled the warlock's mm, demon form. Damn, that was actually interesting. That was actually such a high-level move that uh, is fucking hurting my brain right now, I'm gonna be honest. We do need to see what they have, because I feel like this is the geared homie. But there was at least three fucking warlocks in the pre-lobby that I've seen. Oh, this is another one. <laughs> well, that's two of them. That's good. Good for us. I like killing warlocks. I mean, this is like basically my uh, hobby, you know? Other than killing other rogues. But uh, recently, fucking rogues evolved and I'm the one who's getting killed. <laughs> but yeah, well, at least I can still kill warlocks. But it's just a matter of time before they get better, because the warlock stuff is actually really busted, I'm gonna be honest. The demon- oh, wait. What is the homie doing? He's not doing any damage? He's hitting my limbs! He's just hitting my limbs! Not a single body shot! Bro, what the fuck was that? He didn't use demon form, he didn't use nothing. Well, I guess this is the warlocks that I could kill. First homie, just try to squeeze in before the demon form, which gives you 50 health. Which, like, with the purple pot will literally eradicate the power of uh, judgment. And the second homie just fucking fully committed both dip. Also without demon form, I'm not sure why. Basically, demon form just gives you so much fucking stats, it's ridiculous. Not using Dimmer Form is a mistake. Here we have a little barbarian. Oh, he got clapped hard. That judgment fucking eradicated him. I know that for a fact. Because um, when you use the little thing, you know, for HP recovery, basically you lose like 15 or 20% health. I forgot exactly, but you're going to get, you know, um, some HP back each and every time you hit someone. So... Yeah, when you get blasted by spells. Well, yeah, that's actually gonna hurt quite a bit for sure. Oh god, this guy was looted. Holy hell, yo, I thought this homie wasn't really much. I didn't think he is geared, brother. What the hell is that? Doesn't make sense. Interesting. Hmm. We gotta quickly check what the barb has. I don't think he was that geared, though. He looked like a timid to me. Holy fuck! More green smiles? God damn! Oh shit, holy hell. Yo, those are gonna be expensive. Damn, which one should I take? Okay. 
The bear pendant for sure. That's gonna be some money. Okay, that yeah, that fucking sucks. Oh shit, this cloak is one thousand gold. Yeah, no, I definitely gotta take the cloak. It's fucking money right here. Oh well, I guess I'm gonna throw one of the outfits. Well, pretty much this is what we ended up getting by going back and forward. Got a good chunk of cheese. Very geared lobby to my surprise. All the geared players in one place. Alright, so there is a couple of people that are actually quite dangerous in this lobby. One, it's the Bard. Two, that's the Warlock. Also, there was a Barbarian that I'm quite interested in killing. So I hope, I really hope we come across those. Because that's where I'm gonna get all the cheese. I do need to be careful with the Warlock. Cause, oh, by the way, we have a Bard here. Mr. Bard. Let's see what he's up to. Probably what I'm doing here doesn't really make any sense, does it? Because, <laughs> yeah, you're gonna be fucking... You're not a rogue, bro. You're a fucking fat cleric. What are you fucking talking about? <laughs> no, no, what I mean here is basically, even if I try to crouch up, it's just not gonna make any fucking difference at all. you either rogue with the creep or you loud fuck. Simple as that. Well, I mean... Fuck it. Let's just go. Okay, this is the scary bard, by the way. That's the barb. Okay, so I gotta keep an eye out. I wonder if the warlock in this lobby, I mean in this style. Yep, this is the warlock. This is the warlock with a bunch of magical damage. If anything, I'm gonna go fuck with the warlock first. Oh, what the fuck. No, no, this guy possessed the major threat to most of us here. I'm pretty sure everybody understood the assignment. Mr. Warlock gotta go first and then we'll try to figure out with the rest. That bard has also like 150 health. Rondel, Buckler, like, you know, he got all the cheese. He has like a 40 plus PDR, 45 or something. Oh yeah. Oh, looks like the homie is uh, fighting the um, Warlock. Well, if anything, we gotta kill the Warlock first, period. Okay, Warlock is dead. Party chip? Oh shit, you're right. <laughs> That's some homie party chip. Okay, well, let's kill the barbarian really quick. Oh shit, I didn't even recognize that. Yeah, that's the homie, that's the homie. <laughs> party chip plays warlocks, fucking makes me rage and hate my life. Basically, this is what he does from game to game. <laughs> he got some revenge, but from a bard. Let's see what he has. Oh yeah, oh yeah, it's it's usual, you know. Oh, what the fuck is the homie doing? Homie is drinking milk. Mm, give me some of that, brother. Mm, ideally, ideally, the only way for me to kill this guy is to make him think that I'm hurt enough so that he's gonna end up pushing me. Fuck. Fuck! I could have simply pushed him, bro, and like, you know, hit him with my E, but I just didn't expect he would get stuck. How the fuck do you even get stuck here? Alright, so this is the play. I'm gonna let him hit me a couple of times, pretend that I'm super hurt, and maybe that will work out. Maybe he'll try to jump in. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. What the hell? What am I supposed to do? Maybe let him hit me a couple more times. I'm basically a fool, but uh, does he know that I'm full? Fuck, maybe he does. He changed his mind. Probably shouldn't have used the blue potion. That was a mistake. Bro, he's... Keep... Sipping milk. Holy hell. Stop. Okay. Okay, looks like he's doing damage, he's doing damage. Oh, 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 good, 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 good. Oh, shit, I got hit. Oh, no. Oh, shit, what am I supposed to do, brother? Oh, no. He's about to fucking push me. 
Okay, well, maybe I should not be getting hit in the head. Oh, actually, kind of throwing here. Okay, well, it kind of worked out at the end, but still. I guess getting stopped in the brain is not a healthy. <laughs> I don't think he stopped me in the head that many times, but probably majority of the hits were body hits. Because, yeah, that kind of felt fucking painful a little. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, my homie is scared. Hell, yeah. Hell, yeah, brother. Definitely not bad. Mm, that survival bow is, like, easily... Seven to eight hundred gold. Those rock boots with armor is also gonna be some money. Not a bad raid so far. Bro. <laughs> oh man. He's a fast one. That's beautiful. <laughs> Ah, shit. Honestly, I don't even know how am I supposed to catch up to the guy who is so f much faster. The guy genuinely is not interested in fighting me, and basically he's been running away each and every single time. Also, he's completely not interested in fighting me. Like, uh, sitting by a door definitely not gonna help because he's just not gonna go. He judgment me, maybe that's gonna help me a little, let's see. If he hits me here once, he dies. Nope, he decided not to go for attack. That would be his death, so he did the right move. If anything, he's playing the right way. Because right now, I just have more stats than him. If he decides to fight me in the close fight, he will die. Oh, okay, well, yeah, that's... Decide to... <laughs> uh, cast the judgment on the mummy. That's definitely not gonna help him much. And the thing is, he is faster than I... Oh. Fuck, if the mob would block him, that would be such a good kill him. I really want to get his gear, but it is too fast. Oh. Ah, I fucked up. Well, maybe I'll catch up. Let's see. Nah, the homie is gone. Whatever. At least we have a bard here. We have a bunch of bards in this lobby. We have like four bards, honestly. And maybe we get to kill a couple of them. Oh, this is the geared homie. Think I waste that motherfucker. That homie right there was the geared wither that was fucking scaring me off a lot. And it looks like the oh wait, there's not just one bard, that's two bards. Oh, they're homies. <laughs> it's okay. One bard, two bards. I'm a motherfucking cleric. Oh yeah, they're big time homies. Well, two bards is manageable, you know what I mean. Goodbye. Oh. Oh, I hit him with smite. Beautiful. Oh, one more. And one more. Boom. Pika Vista, motherfucker. Pika. <laughs> GG. Oh, look, this is the fighter who is fighting mobs. We gotta help him. Come on, man. No, I'm not gonna attack you, brother. Don't worry. No, 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 no. Oh. Uh, what just happened? No. Not like this, brother. No. I didn't mean it. Fuck. I probably made him die. Shit. That's not what I meant, trust me. I didn't want him to die, brother. At all. Hell no. Nah. This is fucking sad. Holy hell, the wizard that was dead here is fucking juice. God damn. I would assume two bards teamed up to kill the wizard. Yeah, they def- Oh, it's fucking someone took him. Oh well. It looks like the bards teamed up. That's the only way for them to kill this giga geared wizard. Because um, otherwise, I don't see a single possible way for them to get the Wither done. That Wither homie had 150 health, 50 PDR. Very chunky boy. Alright, so I came across the Warlock, who seemed to be very chill. I told him that, listen, brother, we're all good here. 
no need to fight we'll just um extract because there was no good players you know but the homie decided to fucking fully commit to me and um well just for you to know this guy is almost naked he literally have nothing and i was literally two hits away from dying one more combo i would have fucking died here holy hell and this guy is a completely fucking naked oh shit i think we have a player here bro oh well one more oh shit i got them he headshot me by the way I don't think he is geared at all, but uh, yeah, holy hell, probably shouldn't have fucking... <laughs> I thought he finished the combo, but I guess he didn't. I guess he fucking didn't. Yeah, this homie didn't have much. Let's go check what the Warlock has. Okay, let's see what the Warlock has. True, true... Two true physical damage, that's all. Well, that's not a lot. I didn't take the cloak with true physical. That's probably would be 300 gold right there. Oh well. I heard someone behind the door. Oh yeah, he's like fucking right here. One, one more, little blast. Boom. <laughs> you have a cleric here. Did he went fucking invis or something? Oh, he did. He fucking went invis. Oh shit, and he fucked up big time. Oh no, he's fucking fast. Bro, if you would try to land at least one attack, he would have died here, but he did the right choice to run away. Oh. Okay. He knows what he's doing. I'm invested. You stay away from me, Debo. <laughs> Debo. No, don't strip Debo. Keep your clothes <laughs> on, man. Keep your clothes on, bro. No, 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 we're gonna get him. He's gonna go use the elevator, I think. If he's not gonna use the elevator, at least I will have the upper ground. Yeah, he just did. Bitch, he's gonna close the door. Okay. Oh, man. He's gonna fucking use the shrine. You bitch. And I don't have the judgment. Oh, well. It's okay. Okay, now he is interested. Now he is fucking interested. <laughs> Demo, get back here, boy. I want, I want a match with you. <laughs> okay, GG. Yep. No, I'm running away. <laughs> I gotta get my fucking cooldowns back. We'll fight again in a second. You can get people off guard here, on stairs. Or uh, up there as well, so it's up to you where you want to take them up. But he's gonna keep chasing me here. I'm gonna have an upper ground. I'll be able to get a free judgment. That's one. That's two. That's three. One more. Juju. Oh yeah, homie is scared. Hell yeah. Oh, that's the homie. That's the homie. Hell yeah. And I will be able to fit in his whole gear set beautifully. Bruh. The wizard. I've been fighting him for the past two minutes at least. I think he put himself in a really bad position if he's gonna keep trying to fight me like that. He already wasted majority of his zaps, fireballs. He got some what? Some magic missiles. Some lightning strikes. Okay. Well, that did hurt a little. Freak. Wait, he just decided to use a red potion like that? Use a spread there? Oh, that frosted me down a little. Okay, choo -choo. I'm genuinely surprised how you can switch up fucking gear to the faster one and just matter of a fucking second. That's actually hilarious. Bro, even this homie is fucking fully geared. Like, what the heck? <laughs> a bunch of purple rings. My homie. Oh shit, this guy is dangerous, by the way. Oh, fuck you. Okay, that's one. Holy fuck, he does damage. 
I somehow missed. Oh, fuck me. Almost died here, by the way. Bro, since when barbarians can kill you in four hits? What the hell? It's like he fucking headshotted me three out of fucking three times. Because just for you to know, I have 170 health and I have 60 PDR. 60% PDR, that's just too much. Like, he was not supposed to be physically do this much damage to me, like, no matter how fucking hard he tries. If he's gonna pull out the fucking Felon Axe, I'm just gonna walk the fuck away till I'm full. Oh. Well, that's not a big of a deal to me, though. Could've tanked five more hits, and I'll be just fine. Yeah, we gotta heal here, just in case. I've been getting third party so fucking many times in the past couple of days, it's ridiculous. Probably may not even be a bad idea to just go ahead and use the fucking blue bandages. Just simple as that. Looks like the withered homie is friendly. Okay. Now you never know when you're gonna attack you, you know what I mean? I have trust issues. I don't trust people. But, um... Damn, this guy is geared. Holy hell. No fucking wonder he was hitting me this hard. He got some actual cheese. Homie is fucking ready. I'm used to playing barb that I'm fucking immediately trying to equip the axe. <laughs> but it doesn't work. You're a fucking cleric main now. Nah, I'm kidding. I just really enjoy playing the cleric, you know? Just, we got a little bit of a cleric gameplay going. I'm gonna go back to barb and to fighter very soon. Wait, this homie fucking wants some beef? He was the one who was friendly. No, not like this homie. He was the one who was chill. And now he's trying to burn me down like that. Bro. Why like that? Why you gotta do me like that homie? He's gonna walk away from the judgment, this why I'm not really trying to waste my ability. I'm gonna cancel it as many times. Until... Until one more. And one more. Surprisingly, he actually tanked a bunch of hits a lot more than I thought he would. I thought he would have flopped at two hits, but I would assume all the armor that he got from perks and skills actually makes him pretty tough. Okay. Mr. Barbarian. He wants to get some Pika Vista, I guess. One, two. Oh, the second hit hurt. Three. Well, that worked out. Not bad. Damn, that's actually kind of insane that everyone is fucking geared nowadays, like straight up. I don't even have enough space. But I do need to throw at least to get blue rings and necklace. Ah, oh, shit, I don't really have much time. God damn, breath. Oh, what the heck are those? Those are 1,000 market. I know that for sure. I usually don't play a high roller because there's too many teamers. And um, basically, the first game I went in a high roller, I came across a fighter who didn't want to push me. Which is the right thing for him. You're basically not allowed to push a PDR cleric. I was trying to play dumb so that, you know, if he thinks that, um, I don't know, what am I doing? Trying to do a little <laughs> weird wiggles. But, um, unfortunately, unfortunately, the homie kept the distance and kept shooting at me. He ended up shooting me a total of 23 times at the leaf. Up until the point, we come across a random ranger that just decided to help him. I tried to open the door, but I got pushed away. I decided to push the fighter. I was getting continuously pinched down little by little, even though that wasn't a lot. Tried to go down, I tried to squeeze in. Probably should go gone directly for that door, but um, I went down instead. It was a mistake. I haven't played um, much as a solo versus two. And basically, the range is your counter when you're playing on the cleric. Rangers are your direct counter. And... Um, well, one is enough, <laughs> two is about enough. Thing is, when I was playing with the exact same build on the fighter, I was somehow able to kill um, clerics just fine. But, uh, 
This was different. I messed up with closing the door and I get clubbed. Well, unfortunate reality. Got shot down. The fighter got me. Good for him. Genuinely good player. I do understand that teaming is allowed and um, I guess it's okay, but if you do team, well, you fucking suck dick, especially in situations like this, where you just go in and fucking blatantly team up without any comms. The homie said he was live and that he was not pre-teaming, but it doesn't change the fact that they both suck dick and um, fucking targeting one player like that and not fighting afterwards is a fucking disastrous behavior, I would say. Like, completely fucking experience breaking for both spiders because at some point this shit gonna happen to you. I raged a little bit, I asked him what the fuck is wrong with him, especially if you are a streamer, like, why do we fucking do shit like that? But uh, I said that out of spite and then basically there was no reason for me to act like that. But um, basically, Cleric isn't that broken as of right now. The class has way too many counters, and range is your biggest counter. And including Wizards, Wizards completely destroys you. Bear Druid destroys you. Geared Bards destroys you. More or less, decently geared Rogues possess a lot of threat. So that's pretty much kind of sums it all up. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. It's Timo, and I'll see you in the dungeon. Peace out.